Visionaire ciphers. So to encrypt a message using a Visionaire cipher, the first thing we do, as we've done before, is look up the codes for each one of the letters in the message that we want to encrypt. And in this first example, we're going to use a keyword Zeus. So then what I'm going to do in the next row is write down the word Zeus over and over again so that I have exactly the same number of letters as I do in the message that I want to encrypt. So notice I needed an extra ZE to finish off the message. Then I'm going to look up the codes for each one of those values. And notice that Z is 25, E is 4, U is 20, S is 18, and then we fill those values in again until we finish to the end of the message. Then what we're going to do is add each one of these values, mod 26. So we're going to do 18 plus 25 and reduce it mod 26, and that will give us a number between 0 and 25, which we'll then convert back into text. So 18 plus 25 is 17 mod 26, and that converts to an R. 0 plus 4 is 4, which converts to an E. 13 plus 20 is 33, which reduces to 7 mod 26, so we get H, etc. down the way. Now what I'd like you to do is pause the video and try to encrypt the message happy days using the keyword math. Okay, so if you had encrypted correctly with the keyword math, you do math, math, and then M. And here would be the encrypted message. So you can pause and check your answer. And then we're going to go through one decryption. Okay, so for this message, we're decrypting instead of encrypting. The only difference here is when you put the keyword down, you're going to subtract the value from the keyword, mod 26, instead of add. So this part looks the same. We convert those to the corresponding numbers, get those values. Then the keyword is dog, so we're going to write dog, 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 dog. And we have an extra D. We're going to look those up. So D is 3, et cetera, on down the way. Then we're going to subtract 15 minus 3, we get 12. 14 minus 14, we get 0. 25 minus 6, we get 19, et cetera, on down the way, since we're decrypting. And lastly, we'll look those numbers up to see what the corresponding message is. And of course, we learn math is awesome. But we already knew that. So I hope that helps, and have a great day.